Alright, everyone's evolved. We just need to get everyone caught up. Kina's able to hold her own against um, Ren finally, and Shikiaki can handle the Kinas, and that will hopefully work out for us, and then we can finally get this grinding taken care of. Ominous Wind. That's a ghost move, isn't it? Yes, it is. An anonymous haze that may increase all user stats. Only has five uses, but it's pretty strong in when it ever, whenever it procs, it's a decent proc. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop absorb. It's way too weak to take advantage of, and we can always use more ghost abilities. Poison Bomb! Yay! This is like top tier stuff. Yeah. Toxic Sludge is hurled at foe. It may poison the target. Does a lot more damage than uh, Toxic Gas. So I'll take that. Yeah, it's the defense thing. Don't need it. Barrier. Reason type, uh, the user creates a sturdy wall that raises, sharply raises its defense stat. Um, it's kind of like uh, Reflect, but for defense rather than um, special defense, I guess you could say. So that's why I think it is. I usually don't mess with those. Ego Drain! Pretty decent move to have. Question is, is what should I replace it with? Ominous went. We're obviously it's either poison jab or poison bomb, and poison bomb does more damage. So I'll go ahead and get rid of um, poison jab finally. So now she has a ghost move, miasma move, grass move, and a water move. She definitely gets a good variety. Awesome, she finally learned a new move. Extra sensory. Extra sensory, faith move, special type, 80 damage, it can cause flinching. Pretty awesome. Um, gonna go ahead and drop chorus. As much fun as chorus is. Gunk shot. That's new. Powerful attack that may poison the opponent. 120. This is the top tier, I guess, uh, poison move. But just like most top tier uh, abilities, they have a miss chance. And you already know my opinion on such things. I mean, it's 25 extra damage. It's also physical, so I might as well drop it. I mean, 75% seems pretty decent, but in all my RPGs, if it's if it's not 100%, it's it's gonna miss for me. <laughs> Light screen. Faith move uh, cuts damage from special attacks for five turns. Don't want it. Call mine. Book 
because it's fine to raise special attack and special defense. So it's like bulk up. Sure, I'll take it. I'd rather have that than in prison. Tailwind. Didn't we try to learn this before already? Attack and speed stats, don't need it. Oh my freaking god, are you serious? Heal up. Stop critting, please. Thank you. Alright. Force bomb. Dead. And there we go. Level 50. Mock punch. A punch thrown at blinding speed, it is certain to strike first. Don't really need first strike in this game as much, especially with only 40 power. It's all about big hitting now. Alright. So, I'm gonna go ahead and clean up these last few encounters. Shouldn't take us very long. Alright then, let's um, fly back. And we'll take a look at what we have. So yeah, Shikiyaki, pretty decent defense and speed and all that good stuff. Aya, it's still fantastic with her attack and speed. Ellis is, well we didn't do anything with Ellis, she's still the same as we, where we left her. Uh, Hina has a lot of special defense, other than that she's pretty kind of meh and everything else. Um, Chen, all about attack and, oh my god that's some ridiculous speed right there. Mei Ling, attack and defense. And yeah, that's about it. Pretty standard stuff. Uh, we have a bazillion dollars to spend, so let's go ahead and do that real quick. Um, for right now, item take. Item give. I'm gonna focus on Shikiyaki, um, experience-wise, uh, because we still need to get her a better psychic move, or a better uh, reason move, rather. So, without further ado, let's go to Celadon City. We got a couple things we need to get a hold of. Well, needless to say, if I end up wiping again to the point where I need a, a new party, I will probably go ahead and invest in a uh, Versus Seeker. At that point, you might as well. And if I get to that point, I'm, I will consider... Um, consider going um, to the, the 60 boat Bonico requirement as well, getting that taken care of. Anyway, we'll go ahead and buy Shadow Ball. I don't remember if we even got this, but now we have it one. And let's go ahead and get the Steel Fist. So there you go. Got those. Shadow Ball. Uh, Ellis is the only one that can learn it. It would probably be pretty good for her. I don't know if she learns it on her own or not. But I am completely fine with using it, so use Shadow Ball. We will teach it to Ellis. So now she has an additional attack that she can use. We'll place Pain Split. Alright, and the other thing was Steel Fist. A an hard an attack with a steel hard fist, it may lower the foe's defense. It has an accuracy issue, so leave that alone. But now we know about it. Uh, as for that, anything else? Did we ever get camouflage? I 
don't think we ever got camouflage. Nope, we didn't. Let's go ahead and get camouflage. Pretty sure it's a bonus to nature. And now we're broke. Yep, it improves uh, nature type moves. So nice of that, I guess. I'm gonna go ahead and give the swimsuit to Hina because she's the only one that can use it. Uh, besides that, uh, we got the quick claw. We'll go ahead and give that to back to Mei Ling. She was I unequipped it, so give her the donation box while I was grinding. Okay, that's uh, I believe that's what we call progress for once. Or rather, not progress, but we caught up to where we were before with a new team. Alright, so our next thing we're going to be doing is going down the routes uh, in the water. And head into the cave, which we'll probably catch another Bokuna in, and go from there. Uh, the only problem is, is we don't have anyone that's really good at capturing at all. Yeah, that might be an issue. But we'll make do. I'll take a look at the levels, and if they're low, I'm just gonna blaze through them. RC. Level 30. Yeah, we're gonna... It's kind of just unfortunate that most like, you know, um, mooks are you know, like 20 levels lower than the boss, which I guess makes sense in that kind of overall perspective, but still it's very annoying to deal with. Anyway, uh, Parsi is vulnerable to Faith. Alright, so yeah, we're just gonna blaze our way through this stuff. Uh, you're a hurt ghost. You are part steel. Not sure what you hit me with, but it didn't hurt. We can catch something here if we happen to run into anything. We hopefully will. Hopefully a Kamachi or something, because we need some variation. Well, we just need more numbers. Because the more different types we get, the less I'll have to grind in the future to get up to, you know, 60. I am kind of tempted to go all the way, go beyond the um, Elite Four just to see what happens. Um, but that's only if we make it. Okay. Alright, what do you got for me? Uh, we have already caught a Marasa. I would apologize for being higher level, but honestly, you saw what I had to go through against freaking Patch with uh, Sabrina. This was a necessity. One point, at one point or another, it will be a necessity, and telling the next gym leader is going to be a higher level than what we just encountered. Um, yeah, we'll probably end up having... We'll probably be just within the, the level requirements. It's really hard to say, because the level... The level jumping is kind of weird, to say the least. We've already caught you. It's a double battle. If it is, I want Ellis. Nettery and Hina. But you kind of regret things now, don't you?
Definitely like the uh, sprite for Shikieki. At the very least, we get to see her face on like the back of you know Ellis's head right there. Swimming's great sunburns art. I can agree with that, I suppose. All right, slaughtering time. Next. Oh, that's right, you are a part ghost. Not sure why she's part ghost, of all things. I don't recall her being dead. Also, I'm not sure why that swimmer had a Yuka, but whatever. Um, kill you. Best thing to kill Cerno with? Reason. She can't handle it. Or fire, I suppose. I mean, that'll probably be more accurate. Level up, boo. Mana burst. Finally. You already know about mana burst. It's super powerful. A lot powerful than Psybeam. Only has 10 uses, but that's okay. Play side beam. So now Shikieki is ready to rock. In fact, I might use her for the fire gem. Double change. Anyway, the plan is just to kill everything and go from there. Fought you already. At this rate, I'm gonna run out of moves. All right, now we're on Route 20, which we can catch something here as well, but probably not. All right, uh, what else we got going for us? Sentry dead. Thank you. Bye bye, Kamachi. Bye bye, Kamachi. Alright, they're getting steadily stronger, that's good. Hey, Nettery. Bye, Nettery. Trainers of water, blah blah blah. Okay. And we can also hop in here real quick and say hi. Alright, first thing we catch here, uh, encounter here, we can catch. For what it's worth. Um, I guess we'll stick with Shiki Eki. Of how many? Uh, okay, we got a few. I could use a repel and try to go after the legendary down here. Uh, the legendary is the eyeballs boss from a PC, one of the PC 98 games, who is a miasma type. Don't know much about him. I kind of just killed him because I didn't really care about him. Oh, you also have to have strength for this place. So you might as well make use of it. Alright, what do you got for me? Sir now. Not surprised. Let's, uh. I'm just gonna start throwing orbs at you and hope for the best. Awesome. So there you go, got ourselves a Sir now. She might actually be close to um, evolving as well, which will be nice. A uh, small ice fairy who claims herself as the strongest in Gitsokyo. Which will be good, because then I can essentially already get an additional Bonica on my um, art book. So that brings us up to 
44. Six more, we can get ourselves the um, XP share. And ten more after that, we can get access to the National Dex, which will give us a huge variety of new Bokuna evolutions to mess around with. Aw, oh, we could have gotten Letty. Oh well. Die. Oh, I've already... You only have to activate strength once per floor. Uh, unfortunately, I don't remember what way is the right way. You can actually drop down the holes as well. So yeah, if you don't have the um, the, bol the boulders blocking the current, you won't be able to swim. Oh, we could have gotten a new! That would have been awesome! I don't know what new is besides what game she's kind of from, but that would have been unique. Oh well. Uh, she's a dark type, I believe. Okay, she isn't a dark type. Oh well, my bad. Didn't realize it was going to be that awesome. Alright, um, who do we want to level? You are a dark type. Not sure. I guess Hina to get ready for the gem, because she's pretty much our main attacker for the fire gem. change the flow of, of the water. Indeed they will. So you're a ghost type. And if you try to jump down here, yeah, current is much too fast. Surf can't be used here. So you gotta do something to stop the current. I want to, I could cast Repel and go for or to cast Repel. Sorry, Dungeons, uh, sorry, Dragon Warrior reference, I guess. Uh, we could use a Repel and just kind of make, make our way through. Um, alright, so what we need to do here... Push you. Push you. Push you. Care of both of those. Yep. Now that current, that this section of the water is safe, and we can get access to the legendary that's right here, who is a uh, miasma type, which is kind of bad because we don't actually have anyone. Well, I have um, Shigeki, but she's uh, kind of uh, out of power points. So we can use Chen. Shin has Dig, which is strong against it. Yow! You get. So yeah, this is a Miasma type. She, uh, it is a it is vulnerable to Earth and Reason. So we will go all out and hope for the best. Toxic. Good hit, good hit. Gunk shot. Missed, thankfully. Yeah, top tier Miasma moves go, uh, on a legendary is not surprising at all. Alright, one more should do it. Gunk shot! Okay, I took the hit. 
dick. And there you go. Bye bye, legendary. There you go. Nice work. Alright, let's swap in, uh, Hina. Yeah. And we'll just keep going. Can't do anything here because of the current. I think that's just something to sell, if I recall. Yeah. Because the swimsuit's the thing that boosts water damage. Revive. Alright, let's backtrack the other way, because I think I need to go that way instead. Um, there's a bomb. Heart. Pretty much lets you get a uh, technique evolution going. Which is meaningless until after the game's over, essentially. Go up or down? Go down first, see what that's all about. That's what I figured, alright. Burning out of poison attacks. Did this stuff, I believe. Yeah, we did that part. Oh, that's right, I've already pushed down the boulder. Oh, I just need to jump in. I'm pretty sure we went this way. Yeah, looks like it. Alright. Wow, a lot of encounters here. Wow, come on, sheesh. Now we can go here. Now we're done. We can now navigate through this. Pretty sure we went that way already. Yes, we did. So we just need to go up this way. And there you go. Completely optional, you don't actually have to go that way. The other way you can get to Cinnabar Island is of course going back to Pallet Town and heading south. Which we may be doing. Um, but first we're gonna go say hi to this person. Oh. Tokiko, hi. God, I hate you so much. Thank you. Another Tokiko, alright. Can't 
use the same move in a row. Fine, train. Oh wow, Zen Headbutt actually hurts me. Oh yeah, that's because I'm a freaking Miasma type. Duh. Wasn't even paying attention to that fact. Good thing she didn't crit. Alright, let's keep going. Alright, and I am out of moves. If you ever run out of moves on a Bonica, they will it'll state that they have no moves left, and then they'll use um, something called Struggle, which is a weak move that will also damage them. So you generally don't want to rely on it. Um, uh, Mei Ling. Mei Ling will probably be useful for the um, final battle against Giovanni. So we'll go from there. Suwaku. Not sure what type she is in this game. Um, in the other game, she's like a ground water type or something like that. Ow. Wow. Star Sapphire also knows energy light? Go figure. We are Center Bar Island. So we can go ahead and rest here. And I want to pay a visit here. And what we can do here is. Is it you? I can either give him the mini Hakuro or the air scroll that we got. The air scroll will give us Byakren. And the mini Hakuro will give us, um, Hak uh, not Hakure, it will give us uh, Kirasame, which is essentially a PC-98, um, Marissa. Um, I think Byakuren is probably a bit cooler, so I'm gonna go ahead and pick, actually, I will let the dice decide. 1 through 3 will be mini Hakuro, uh, 4 through 6 will be the Air Scroll. Either way, uh, it will give us another Bonica to mess around with. So, here we go. One. All right, so we're gonna go with Mini Hakuro. Not a big deal. It's a fossil of C. Marissa, a Bonaka that is already extinct. Sure, we'll go ahead and get Marissa. All right, there you go. I'll take take a lot of time, walk for a while. Okay. How about now. You. Yes, we'll give you a name. Your name will be Marissa. I guess in this game it's actually just Marissa, not Kirasame. In um, the other games where they have uh, quite a variety as well, um, they will have the standard Chibi Marissa and you know their ev in her evolutions, and then there will be Kirasame, who is what usually you get from the fossils, who's the PC98 version. All right, so Marissa. Thank you. So that's our one Bonica for this uh, for this city. Um, there is the burnt uh, mansion or whatever here, and I consider that a dungeon. So that'll be another place we can get a Bonica. And we're now up to 45 Bonica. Pretty nice. Anyway, let's take a quick look and see if we can find our. Uh... There she is, Wind type. Always full of energy and trying to learn new spells often makes uh, makes pranks. Okay, pretty standard. And we'll pull up some information, because we haven't done that in a while. Um, to, to Monica. Alright, here's Marissa, level 5. Place. Summary. Alright. Uh, naive nature. Uh, pick up, may pick up items. You already know what I feel about that special trait. And she starts out with Thundershock and Snatch. Pretty standard stuff. She'll, she generally will learn Thief and some other electric moves, and I think eventually if she evolves she becomes like a Wind Reason type. Alright, um, summary for Star now. 
Relax nature. Uh, vital spirit prevents sleep. Always nice. Has literally no special defense whatsoever. Um, but has okay attack and special attack and speed. Starts out with nothing but ice moves, including ice punch. Go figure. Alright. Not too shabby. All rested up. And once we defeat this gem and we exit it, um, we will get access to uh, the other a few other islands. And also we have Senator Bar Island's uh, fiery town of Burn- Oh, that's not how it, what it's called. Well, we'll get, there's the abandoned mansion here, and here we gotta get the key to get access to the gem. Uh, but first, we're gonna fly all the way to Pallet Town. Well, since we've been to Pallet Town, let's say hi to Mom. Hi, Mom. Thank you. Let's go talk to you. Hey, how's it going, Professor? 100 seen, 45 own. Yeah, I've gotten the amulet coin already. Thank you. Alright, so we can get in the water here, and we'll be on Route 21. And Route 21 actually has grass, so I'm going to see what's here, and uh, hopefully we can catch something new. Uh, d d uh, not much else to worry about. Alright. Star Sapphire. I'm sorry that I, you know, got your fr your. I don't know if they're sisters. I'll say sister anyway. I'm sorry I got your sister killed. I have to just throw up orbs and hope for the best, unfortunately. Awesome. And she's pretty close to evolving already, which is nice. Unlike Sunny Milk and Luna Child, Starfire's. Uh, Sapphire's power isn't affected by weather or daytime. I don't think I can fit your full name. Uh, nope, I can't. I cannot fit your full name. Uh, S-A-P... Yeah, I can't. I can't fit at all. So I'm just gonna call you Star. Alright, cool. We got that taken care of. Now fly back to here. And take a quick look at who we have. Oh. Alright, summary. Water type, serious nature. Run away makes escaping easier. Starts out with a variety of moves, including nature's power. Pretty standard stuff. Stats are as to be expected for her. And that's about it. So there you go. We're now up to, what, 46 now? Yep, 46. I would love to get the XP share. I might consider doing that and using this as an opportunity to kind of evolve a few other characters. And then from there, we can easily, very easily reach the 60 requirements, which would be nice. Actually, that scientist guy got anything to say? No. Okay. Door's locked. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, in here we can catch something, so I wanted to go ahead and do that. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have anyone that does status effects, so we're just going to have to hope we pull through. I'm going to go ahead and save, and we'll go in. Bonica Mansion. So I'm just going to hang out here. Because why not? Actually, I'll go upstairs. Why not? Go all the way to the top. Nope, we're not. Rin! At level 28. You can get uh, Romilia here, I believe. You can also catch uh, Patchouli and po possibly a few other characters. I Actually, no, nah, that's not correct. I'm pretty sure that's not right. Usually it's going to be most of the Scarlet Devil Mansion characters, but for this game, it might be just like nothing but fire types. So it could be like Rin, Moko, and Atsuo. In any case, I'm gonna go ahead and throw a hard orb. 
get this started. Nope. Use Ray. Kasha that lives deep underground, capable of carrying away corpses. She has other people call her Oren. I'll just call you Ren. That's generally what I know you as. There we go. I can just head on out. So that brings us up to 47. So if I evolve three Bonica, I can get the um, XP share. So let's um, take a quick look at Ren. Starts out as a beast type, uh, hasty nature, flash fire, powers up if hit by fire. Starts out with beast, moves, fire spin, confuse ray, as well as flame wheel. Pretty good stuff. Okay. And uh, she's more focused on physical attack than special attack. Well, she's focused on physical attack, but she has special defense. And then, of course, she has high speed. So that's kind of interesting. Anyway, we got ourselves quite a batch of Bonica to work with. Anyway, I think that's about everything for now. So I am the Depressed Dior, and this was uh, Toho Nuzlocke. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys later.